hope y'all doing well. Oh, hope everybody knows it's outside. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Fall, fall, fall. Temperatures are changing. Best thing about the temperature dropping, I don't sweat near as fucking much. Yeah, it's about the only time of year I don't sweat. I'll be sitting on the park bench, sweating my ass off. I'll be like, did you just run three miles? I'm like, no, I've been sitting here since the morning time. And I will warn anybody, I do not wear a coat during the winter time. I wear a coat year round. The other thing I really like about this time of the year coming up is Halloween. Halloween is my favorite holiday, and it's not just because I steal my kids' candy and need it. Um, Halloween is my favorite time because it's easy for me to dress up where other people have to spend big dollars on high, high dollar costumes. All I have to do is slip a shirt on, slip on a yellow shirt, I am the sunshine, or a really big mustard stain. Put on a red shirt, I am the Kool-Aid man, ooh yeah. Kids are scared kids though, so I don't do that very much. I can slip on a white shirt, but I have to be careful because if I put just a white shirt on, I'm the moon or the Stay Puft Marshmallow Halloween from Ghostbusters. But if I'm drinking anything and it gets wet, I'm suddenly mistaken for a fat white girl. And that can be dangerous, but it also can be profitable. <laughs> one sweat t-shirt contest and they usually have a cash prize for fucking all minute. And if I'm at a hip hop club, the black guys locked in me all night long. Hey, I think you want me to pay for your drinks, sure thing, player. <laughs> <laughs> it does kind of suck at the end of the night when they want to take you to the VIP room and settle up. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I do have kind of a weight problem. One thing I hate is when people ask me, how much do you weigh? I'm like, I don't know, but at the uh, county fair, I did win a blue ribbon. <laughs> oh, went to the movies the other day, and it was the most erotic movie that turned me on more than anything I've ever seen. It was a movie called Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. <laughs> I saw it in 3D, it was kind of weird because I could get one. <laughs> <laughs> Got kicked out when I was jerking off during the big macaroni and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, this isn't really a joke. My ex wife is a giant whore. <laughs> I made a mistake before me and her got married. We waited until we got married to have sex. And that's a very dangerous proposition. Because on my honeymoon night, I pulled her panties off. <sighs> I got to looking at her pussy, and I'm like, sweetie, I'm going to have to ask for a car patch report on your pussy. <laughs> a hand reached out of her pussy and handed it to me. <laughs> I, I looked at it, and I'm like, wow, your pussy's been involved in flooding? Three accidents. Two total reconstructions. <laughs> That would make dating a whole lot easier, though, if you could get a car back to report on a chick and find out she's been involved in a three way with a black guy and made you. Just make sure you're not wasting your time. <laughs> My wife did have a pretty big pussy, though. And I should have known that before we had sex. Um, I asked her what her favorite lovemaker song was, and she told me it was a hokey pokey song. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, I guess it's Mike and Joe's doing good right now. Y'all didn't notice I have shaved. A uh, couple people noticed it. Saturday night I made a pact to not shave until the Titans won a game. Have Sunday's game, I said, fuck it. <laughs> Back when the Saints sucked so bad, they put paper bags over their heads playing their Saints fans. My suggestion for Titans fans right now, just get a plastic bag, stick it over your head, and tie it off the hand. <laughs> oh. All right, well, four minute mark. Let's do a little self promotion. I will be at the corner bar tomorrow night. But please, everybody, come next week because we're doing something called Joke Swap and me and Riley Fox have switched jokes. So. I can't wait to hear Riley talking about his ex-wife's pussy. <laughs> <laughs> and me talking about politics. Boys like girls. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Thank you. Thank you.